Hello folks, this is Ayat Tanajha from InspireToRise.com and today we have the NATAC N530S 120GB Solid Straight Drive here with us for a detailed unboxing and review of the same. So guys, let's begin. So guys, this SSD comes at a price of around $40 and I bought it from Gearbest.com. The link to the product is in the description below. And let's just start with the unboxing for this device in order to know more about it and how well does it perform. So claimed read write speeds are around 6 gigabit per second and this device itself is of the 2.5 inch SSD format. So 2.5 inch SATA SSD, this is the one. And let's just open it up. You get a warranty card inside NATAC SSD products and you get other things also about it. And this is the SSD itself. So what we are going to do is we will install this SSD in a laptop which we have. And that laptop has a mechanical hard drive at this point of time. We will show you the whole process how to replace. And this is the current read write speed of the mechanical hard drive at 5400 RPM. And it's quite less. You can see that. So this is a Lenovo laptop that we have. Now we have to open this up from the back. And most of the laptops are very easy to open up, just 3 or 4 screws, but some of the laptops are really tough. For example, one of my own laptops that I had to open up, you had to pry open the keyboard also in that case. So that's not the case here. I will link down to that video also in the description. So you can see that there is a hard drive inside, the mechanical hard drive. It's a 2.5 inch format SATA hard drive, 5400 RPM. And let's just open this up. You have to open up all of the screws which attach the hard drive to the laptop and keep all of the screws in a safe position so as to avoid losing them because these are very small screws and more often than not people tend to lose these screws. So just make sure that you keep them in a safe place and once you are done doing that you have to push the hard drive away from the SATA connection very nicely very smoothly and once you are done doing that let's just try this open and push it nicely with the screwdriver and you can see com compare both of these devices side by side and there is a attachment on the sides of the hard drive you have to open that up and you have to install that on your SSD in order to make the SSD ready for installation in your laptop so just open up these screws and then install those metal pieces on the right and left hand side of your SSD so it's an easy process use the right Phillips screwdriver and we are done doing that. Now let's just test on the Crystal Bench benchmark the read and write speeds of the new SSD. So the claimed speeds of around 6 gigabit per second roughly translate to around this speed itself 6, 6 gigabit per second. You can divide it by 8 and then multiply by 1024 to get speeds in megabyte. So this is the kind of speeds that you are getting. Quite good. And the read write speed is quite good but the longevity of the SSD is something that we would need to test on a long period of time. So that would require us some testing and a long period of time. But right now the SSD is performing really great and all of the benchmarks and tests and the Premiere Pro tests that we ran on this laptop after installing the SSD show that the read write speed has definitely improved. Overall performance of this machine has improved by a lot. I would also like to suggest you the thing that when you are buying something from Gearbest.com, more often than not you end up paying huge custom fees and uh, this product itself is of $40 so I had to pay a custom of around 1000 rupees. So try to make sure that those guys package the products as gifts or in some other format so as to avoid paying custom duties because of the fact that these products itself are very cheap and when you buy them with the customs then everything goes really high, the price goes really high. But overall, I would say that for $40, this SSD is really worth it. So guys, this was it for this video. In case you like this one, don't forget to hit the thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel. This is Aitana Jha from InspireToRise.com. Signing off folks, stay inspired to rise.